Hey everybody, hi, welcome, and thanks so much for joining me and the Happy Crew for another video. We're so excited to have you. We're kicking off an outfit of the day, what I wore video. It is Sunday, it's cold, lots to do, and unfortunately, I, I do not feel like I'm kicking you off with an awesome outfit. But, um, see now, what are you doing? <laughs> but the gang is all here and we're ready to go. We've got some work over here we're getting ready to do. And 25 degrees, it is gray outside, cold. We're getting ready for a storm. Ugh, I don't know. The sun will shine again <laughs> in Pennsylvania, I think. Um, but not anytime soon. But that's a typical February, right? The dogs are freshly groomed. They're so soft and silky. Zena doesn't want to work today. Look at her. Wyatt's down here. He just wants loving. Can you see him? No, you can't even see him. Wyatt, come say hi to everybody. There he is. <laughs> He's so silly. All right, we'll talk outfits. You want to talk outfits? Yeah, I took off their bandanas. Actually, I think my husband took off their bandanas. Um, so they don't have those on for today. But since I said I had lots to do, we have some videos to film. I'm going to be changing my clothes a bunch, and I kind of woke up with a little bit of a headache this morning. I grabbed, like, the most comfy thing I saw right off the bat and just put it on, and it is an outfit from Wantable. Basically, like, a set, but it really isn't a set. It's, it's from two different companies. Um, so it's a top from MPG. Basically just a sweatshirt, it has this tie-dye look to it and the navies and blues and has a little bit of pink and burgundy through it. Very comfy, but it's, it's a sweatshirt, um, but I thought it was a little bit dressy, dressier than a sweatshirt, but still casual. And then I put on these uber comfortable um, sweat, basically jogger bottoms from Good Human, also from Wantable. And they have writing on them. What do they say? It says believe on the pocket, um, which you might be able to see in the full view. And they have a little ruching on the ankle. And then I just threw on little slide-on tennies that are Dr. Scholl's. I got it at TJ Maxx a few years ago now. And my earrings are touched in by Swarovski. And that's it, since I'm going to try to do a jewelry video as well as... A trunk club for you guys um, so I'll be changing anyway um, but this is really as good as it got for today <laughs> I'll try to do better for the rest of the week all right well let's get to it right guys you ready happy start to your week hope it's off well and we'll be back tomorrow hey everybody it is Monday already time for outfit of the day crazy morning. Works off and running as usual. <laughs> it is snowing again. We're supposed to be getting another winter storm. We haven't gotten a lot of snow yet, so hopefully it, they're off on how much we're supposed to get. It's supposed to be like four inches to a foot. We'll see. Um, 28 degrees. And for today, I have on a halogen cashmere sweater in this pretty pink color and a pair of J. Crew denim. Both of these items came from a trunk club. My shoes are from Stitch Fix Shop Your Looks by Seychelles. Put some grippers on today in preparation for the snow. Um, and then I have this awesome jacket, coat um, from, who's this by? Anthropology. I got in with like my very first newly I kept. In love with this, love the pretty colors on it. Still trying to bring on those spring vibes. Huh, Wyatt? What do you think, buddy? <laughs> And for jewelry, let's see, I have on a Druzy set from Rock's Box, the necklace and earrings to match, and a ring I think I got from Leah Sophia. And that's it. All right. We're off and running for the week. Hope everyone's week is starting off fab, and we'll be back tomorrow. Hey, everybody. It is Tuesday. I had to think about it for a minute because yesterday felt like one really big, long day, so I almost feel like it's still Monday. <laughs> Oh my, um, we were supposed to get a bunch of snow, but instead we got rain, so it is um, super cold outside, 27, um, which is cold, uh, And but I think not as cold as some of you may be getting, but it feels cold. And the gang's all here for up of the day, huh? 
so the the sidekicks are like a little um, perturbed lately because my husband rescued a cat. I've never owned a cat before, um, so I don't understand cats. <laughs> but this poor cat had um, was had ice, like frozen ice on its little mouth and some on its body. So he brought it in our house um, on Friday to try to, you know, save it because it, the poor thing was um, in trouble. So it was in my, it's in my basement still. It's now Tuesday. Um, and I'm trying not to get attached because I don't know what's going to happen because the poor thing is really sick. So finally yesterday I took it to the vet. I told my husband to do it but he didn't. So I did. I took it to the vet because um, it's not eating. Um, it seems to have like a respiratory infection and um, I'm hoping that's all that's wrong. So I took it to the vet, found out it's a girl. Um, it's pretty sick. So the vet's not sure if it's older or not. He thinks, but he's not sure. Um, he doesn't know if she's going to make it or not make it. So um, it's been stressful for all of us. So we're, I've never had to care for a cat. The dogs know there's this animal in the basement. They want to go see it. Um, she's not, she's very sweet. Um, she doesn't really uh, act aggressive or anything like that. She wants likes to be left alone. But the poor little thing has stuff just leaking from her little eyes or nose. I feel so bad for her. Um, so she's gotten a antibiotic shot. She now has a steroid shot and um, we're hoping she makes it through the week. Um, so the vet wants me to d make sure she's doing better by Friday and if she isn't then I have to do the humane thing which I really ugh, don't want to have to do that. So he thinks that we should know within a couple of days she should start to feel better and start to eat because we haven't seen her eat yet. We've tried. <laughs> we went out bought her a litter. We bought her food. Um, and again, we know nothing about cats because I have not, I've never owned a cat in my life. I even bought her a toy because I felt she was bored in the basement. Uh, but anyway, so I'm hoping she pulls through. Poor little thing. I feel bad for her. Um, I think she just really has, I'm hoping it's just a bad cold and the medicine will kick in here very, very soon. But she, I don't think she's even drinking and that's what really has me worried about her. Anyway. <sighs> Long story, you guys probably didn't even need to know. <laughs> anyway, let's talk about outfits because that's what we're here for, right? Um, for today, I chose a pair of Pistola pants that I got in a Stitch Fix. These are really comfortable, actually. Um, they're like a cargo pant. They're very comfy. Have the little zippers at the um, hip. And I put on a loft cozy sweater with it. Um, this one's a nice soft like v-neck sweater it's so nice and warm because today i just want to be warm and i threw on a scarf i got it ever eve again just to keep warm it just feels like one of those days where you just want to wrap up in a blanket um, and not work <laughs> unfortunately not an option today and um my shoes hi hello Zina wants to say hi hello there my shoes are um dolce vita i got these at nordstrom rack a couple of years ago. And for jewelry, I have on um, my set from Brighton that I shared with you all. And then my earrings are also Brighton and these were a Christmas gift. Yeah. And that is everything. What do you think, see? Huh. Zena just wants the treats. Zena just wants the treats because I had to bribe her to come up here. Okay. Okay. All right. So that is Tuesday, and we'll be back tomorrow. Hey guys, so it is hump day, and we're here for outfit of the day. The gang is all here. It's a cold day, 21 degrees. We're expecting some sort of storm tonight with ice and all kinds of crap. But um, before I even start off the day, my heart goes out to everybody in Texas and the surrounding areas that are being hit with horrific weather, power outages. I just can't even imagine um, what is going on because I don't think in Texas that you are prepared for the kind of weather that we typically get in Pennsylvania and I hear it's like awful. Um, so thoughts, prayers, all kinds of positivity coming your way. Um, 
and I hope that everybody is safe because I, I can't even imagine. Um, I, I don't know. <laughs> 2021, or yeah, 2021 has felt a bit of a um, continuation of 2020 so far, I'm telling you. Um, so I hope everyone is safe, and I hope we can get to, to spring when things start to really warm up. Although in Texas, I thought it usually is warm, so I'm not sure what is going on with Mother Nature right now. Um, <clears throat> but I do think some of the surrounding states are getting hit as well. So please let me know you guys are okay. Because I'm sending lots of uh, thoughts and prayers to each and every one of you. All right, so what do we got going on for today, Z? Huh? Lots of work. Lots of work today. <laughs> You're so silly. You're so silly. Yes, you are. Okay, let's do after the day now. Ready? Are you ready? Zena just wants to skip straight ahead to treats. All right, so for today, um, <laughs> I have on a chaser tea that I got uh, last year, I think on sale at Ever Eve, and I had gotten it to go with, I think, a specific jacket. Um, but I like this one, it's fun, long sleeve, it's cozy. Uh -huh. It's kind of got like a paint splatter effect and this fun little tiger on it, it says love. And um, yeah, I got it from Ever Eve. I have on a pair of jeans that are cut from the cloth I just got from Nordstrom during their sale. I am putting it on with my fun little teddy trucker coat here that I also got uh, from every but in a trend send. This one is by Cupcakes and Cashmere. It's just so soft, nice and warm. It's like fully lined. And then I put on Zena's, <laughs> Zena's hidden under here now. And then I put on my sorrels because it's, it's snowy and crappy. So these have like the fun grippers at the bottom. They're a wedge heel. I love these. Got them at Nordstrom. And my jewelry. This is a necklace from the Everage store. My earrings I just did, got, showed you, <laughs> in my Rocks box. My ring this was in my latest Rocks box set. And hey, I'm talking. And now I lost my tra tra train of thought. Was that it? Yeah. Okay, necklace, earrings, ring. Okay, I think we covered it. All right, now you can talk. What do you need? Treats. Okay. All right. And that's it for after the day today. You're so cute. Yes. Okay. You're both very cute. I hope you're doing well. As I said, I hope you're safe and we will be back tomorrow with another outfit. The sidekicks need treats now. Hey everybody. It is Thursday. All right. So it is cold again, 28 degrees, no sun, lots of snow. We're getting more. Um, school was canceled today. So I was <laughs> got the call like before I wanted to get up today. So I was up early, got to bed late, woke up a little cranky um, and put on just put on comfy, cozy pieces that I thought would look decent on video calls. That's about as far as I took it today. So I'm not overly exciting, although I am very comfortable. <laughs> so um, for today, Zena's ready for her treats, aren't you? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. For today, I chose um, a, I think it's, is it Good Threads? What is this one called? Simply Threads. So it's a Simply Threads um, top that I got in a once that I kept because it's just so soft. It feels wonderful on. I love the V-neck. Um, and then I threw it on with a cardigan by Peyton Jensen that I got from a Transcend as well as a pair of cut from the cloth that I got in a transcend. And I have on Dolce Vita high boots that I got from Ever Eve. So it's just a nice cozy, hello, cozy outfit um, because I just am cold today and just want to be comfortable. For jewelry, I have on a necklace from Brighton and earrings you've seen before from White House Black Market. And that's it. What do you think, see? So I hope everyone is doing well. I just, um, yeah, I hope everyone has what they need because I'm now worried about those of you that don't have power and I know there's been rolling power um, power outages and so many things going on right now so thinking about everybody and hoping everybody is safe and has what they need um, while we get through these crazy storms that are going on I know in Texas and some of the surrounding areas so um, lots of prayers to, to anyone who's being affected by that all right Zena wants treats you want to say hi to everybody Mm-hmm. <laughs>
<laughs> She's so funny. What do you think? Huh? Huh? And guess what? Tomorrow is Friday. Yes. Tomorrow is Friday, finally. Yes. All right. So we will see you then. Hey, everybody. It's Friday. Yes, it's Friday. We made it. We made it. <laughs> it is uh, 28 degrees outside. It's very gray. And um, that's why it was just outside and he was shaking his little uh, booty when he came inside. So lots of uh, chills going on there. Huh, why? Because I got all your hair cut off last week, didn't I? <laughs> Poor baby. And now it's so cold. Oh my. Um, so for today, I decided for outfit of the day, I was going to put on a dress because I haven't worn a dress all winter because it's just been so, the weather's been not good in my opinion. And I'm always cold. But I have on this awesome sweater dress from the loft today. How about Ooh. that? And um, I put on my Ugg boots and I'm going to top it off with this fun coat that you guys have seen before. I think I wore it last week too, um, from the loft and the dress is from the loft. And what do you think? Hi. Oh yeah. You like it? Both of you like that? Okay. And, um, for jewelry, I have on my awesome earrings that one of my amazing subscribers sent me. How pretty are those? These are from Nordstrom and my necklace, my husband bought me and a ring from rocks box. And that's my outfit for today. What do you think? Okay, so I told you guys, I'm going to give you a kitty update. So I told you I have this kitty that we're trying to get well. She's very sick. She's very sick. Um, we were, uh, I had a vet appointment today to take her to like humanely euthanize her. But because um, the vet told me that I would either see her get better really quickly or worse really quickly. And neither of those have happened. Um, so she still is in um, some... I want to, I want to say like discomfort. I'm hoping it's not complete distress, but d d discomfort because she still has a lot of drainage coming out of her face, like the eyes and the nose. I feel so bad for her. And I think I told you guys, um, when my husband found her, she, her mouth was frozen. So there was actual ice on it. Um, so she's very sore on her little mouth, right? So it's like blistered. So I think that's, all of that probably is why um, she's not eating or drinking and hasn't been since we got her like a week ago Friday. So we've been really worried about this. So we've been trying every, everything to get her to eat and drink. We've bought her baby food, cat food, everything. The, dog, the vet told us to try. We've tried. My husband bought her meow milk, like everything. Um, but she's not really eating. We do think at this point she has started to drink. Um, water. So we're happy about that. Uh, there is some, some progress. Um, she's moving around quite a bit. So she's not lethargic or anything like that. She moves around quite a bit. Um, she has full reign of our downstairs right now. <laughs> um, but she right now is, is as soon as you open the door to go down, she's at the top landing. So there's like three steps and then a landing and then you go down the basement. She's at that landing. So I put baby food and I heat up some baby food, like just a little bit for her. So she, the vet said like, you know, five, 10 seconds so she can smell it, put it in front of her to try to see if she'll eat it. But I don't think she's really all that interested yet. So I'm really hoping, I mean, none of us are interested when we have a head cold and our mouth is sore. Do we want to eat a whole lot? Um, cause I actually think her mouth hurts her with, you know, cause it was frozen. Oh, <sighs> so anyway, I obviously canceled my, the appointment for today because she hasn't, you know, drastically declined. She hasn't drastically improved. Um, and now we bought like the little like dropper to try to get some water and food in her mouth, which we're going to try. But again, I think her mouth is so sore that I don't even know if we're going to try to do that just yet. So that's our kitty story, huh, Zena? Zena wants to make friends with the kitty. She's not mean or anything. She doesn't really react at all. And Wyatt is like super curious. He doesn't know what to think at all. But until I understand what's really, you know, until she gets well, I don't really want the dogs too close to her. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping she can get well. And even the vet doesn't even know how old she is. He said she could be really old or not. He can't tell she's so sick. It's hard for him to even know at this point. I feel bad for her. Poor little thing. She had no chip or anything. So 
anyway, we'll see what happens. I've, I've like not wanted to name her until we know what's going to happen because I get so attached and then it's like devastating if anything happens. I think I'm sure you guys understand, but we're trying and I know nothing about cats, <laughs> nothing at all. All right. Well, that's wrap. I know you like the kitty. All right. That's a wrap on Friday's outfit. And we'll be back tomorrow with one more. One more, right? Hey, everybody. It's the weekend. It's Saturday. And it continues to be really cold. It is 16 degrees outside. Um, but my thoughts and prayers are still with everybody in Texas and I think Louisiana and the surrounding areas. Um, I hope you guys are okay. It just sounds terrible. Um, and I think, I, I don't think you're supposed to warm up for a little bit longer. So I really hope everybody is doing okay. So my thoughts and prayers are with all of you. Um, we in Pennsylvania, we are used to the cold, but I know you guys are not. So we have been, I think I saw something the other day where it said, I think there was only four states that weren't covered in snow. Um, as of, was it Thursday? I think. Yeah. So those of you in Florida, Georgia, South Carolina, and I believe Hawaii <laughs> are the lucky ones. The rest of us, snow. All right, so we made it to the weekend, and um, time for outfit of the day. Zena's heading for the trees, so if you can see her little tail there. <laughs> she wants me to speed this up and get to the trees. <laughs> You're too funny, Z. All right, so for today, there she is, I chose <laughs> a sweater from a Wantable. You guys might remember this. It has like the little sparkly shimmery on the shoulder, a little bit. It's fun. I forgot I had it. It's really soft, nice and cozy for today, but adds a little bit of bling with the sparkle on the shoulder, which seems blocked a little bit, but hopefully you guys can see that. Um, has a little bit of a puff sleeve, but not too dramatic, and um, in the solid black. See, so you're going to get hurt, honey. Then I just put on a pair of cut from the cloth jeans that I believe I got in a wantable, I think. And then, um, yeah, I'm going to wear my pink cut from the cloth fur, faux fur jacket in love. Just bring the cheer today because it is so cold. And for shoes, I have on, <laughs> you too. I have on, hey, not done. I have on DB8s from Stitch Fix. Shop your looks. They have zippers on both sides. They're super cute. Um, and that's my outfit for today. For jewelry, I put on a necklace from White House Black Market. I have on my Rocks Box hoops I just got, um, as well as the ring I just got. And I think this is fun because you can wear it like different ways. Like you could wear it like half and half like I showed it before, I think. And then I kind of like it where all the um, sparkle is in the front. So I think this is kind of a fun ring. All right. Um, kitty update. I don't know. She's, she's not really showing signs of improvement no matter what we do. We've tried to give her like droppers of food. She just isn't interested. I, I don't think she can smell anything still. <clears throat> so we're, we're not sure, um, what's going to happen here. Poor little thing, but she doesn't really look that much better. The only thing we've noticed is she's drinking and she wasn't drinking before. Um, so that was a positive. So we took that as a sign that, you know, she was starting to improve and didn't keep a, the appointment yesterday. Um, but I'm, I'm really not sure. I, I'm really worried about her. So, um, stop. Anyway, uh, we'll continue to do the best we can, but I, I don't want her to suffer. Um, so hopefully, hopefully she turns around here. Sina, stop. <laughs> All right. Anyway, I want to make sure I share that with you. I will list all my outfits down below. If I can put links to the items, I will. Many of them are boxes, so I'll put links to the boxes. I want to hear what your favorite was this week. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. Really, really appreciate the support. Would love you to hang out for that long haul and hit that subscribe button. And if you already have, thank you, thank you, thank you. Until next time. Bye, everybody.